guys um today we're doing the day in the life and it is currently 7 5 in the morning um i am shattered i've been up most of the night um Raina woke up about 11 p.m when i went up to bed when we went up to bed about might have been about 10 11 and then she was miserable i gave her a bath um after that she was just moaning she would not sleep so i ended up coming downstairs with her putting tv on watching tv and then she finally fell asleep after drinking her milk and then i fell asleep on the sofa as well but then i woke up because i was like cold shivering didn't have no blanket or anything so i came back upstairs to go to bed and that was about 2 a.m and then um slept and then about 4 30 she woke up again um and then I was up for, oh, let me tidy my room, spread the bed, etc. Then I came downstairs at six, well, about quarter to six. And then she finally fell asleep at six. Um, and she's been sleeping since then. So, what is it now? Seven o'clock, yes, yeah, so she's been sleeping an hour now. Um, she's in the living room. But the good thing I did, guys, was I, um, normally I'd be making the packed lunches for the girls now but I already done that from last night. So I think that's what I'm gonna start doing from now on is making their packed lunches from the night before, putting them in the fridge, and then it just makes my morning easier. If I have a night like that where I've not slept, then it's not so um, panicky or rush, rush, because then right now I'd be rushing to make packed lunches. Um, Cause we leave home at eight o'clock. So yeah, today I'm just gonna bring you along with me for a day in the life and um, just show you how the day goes really which is quite fun exciting first thing i always do in the morning is just walk around the house opening all the curtains and blinds and um and obviously spread my bed etc but i've already done that and then i'm gonna go upstairs now and check that the girls are getting ready and almost ready to come down and have breakfast dressed <laughs> so we got one dressed you're still getting dressed and you are dressed you got pee today okay girls don't forget to spread your beds yeah you spread your huh you put it on your notes good yeah, so make sure you do that and make sure your room is tidy before you come downstairs for breakfast, yeah? Good stuff. So, yeah. My room, my bed is spread. Look at that, spread. And I've already opened my blinds and curtains. <laughs> Would you like some help with your bed? Okay, let's go. Okay, so what you can do for mummy is take everything off and then I'll take them off and I'll put them back on for you. Mm -hmm. chicken okay. right you can do the filming for mummy
Hey guys, so it's about 7.26 now. Got up at four o'clock this morning. Didn't have much, didn't get much sleep. Sure was worse, because rain is teething. She have one tooth coming up. So she's a bit miserable during the day and the night. I'm at London Bridge now, just got here. Heading back out soon. So, yeah, this is where I'm at. At 7.27 now. And it's not so cold today. Last few days have been really cold, but today, not so bad. All right, guys, I'll check back in later on. Uh, yeah, as I said, I got up at four. I left out the house around 4.45 to catch the bus. So I had to catch two bus this morning. Which is around, the first one was about 15 minutes, and then the other one was about 20 minutes on it. So in the morning, it's really quick, really. And easy to get to work during the, during the day, longer man. Uh, obviously, more traffic. So, yeah. What are you having for breakfast, Ryan? Should I get you toast? Okay. What are you gonna have today, Rav? Toast. Toast, okay. What about you? What are you having? Cocoa pops with a cocoa pop bar. I'll just, I don't know why you'd have both, but okay. She's having cocoa pops and a cereal bar. And the coffee opens the box. Oh my goodness. I don't know why she's having both the bar and the cereal. Hmm. Oh, so what plate is that? Elsa. Olaf. Ah. <laughs> I don't know what mummy's gonna have. I think I'm gonna have a tea. Peppermint tea. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna have for breakfast. Mm. Yeah. What? What do you mean? No more plates. Can you put this plates here? Do you not have eyes that are stuck to your head? On the front of them? Yes. You don't have eyes. Where's yeah. your glasses? Where are your glasses? Maybe you need them. Mm. <laughs> <sighs> right, let me stop doing it again. It's now 7.30 almost. No, it's not. No, it's not. Where that? It's the same time, Raya. It's just a minute. Of the coffee. Caramel latte, that's my favourite coffee. This is a pasta coffee. Enjoying your breakfast, really? Did you eat the bar already?
Why is it doing that? What does this mean? Oh. What? I don't understand. It's punctured in it. Why is it making that flesh? I do not know what this means and I just want a coffee. Oh my gosh, this is annoying. What's the matter? What is the matter with the coffee machine? It's making noise. Is it broken down? <laughs> I just want a coffee. Does anybody know what this means? I didn't have time to get the book out. The felt is fine, there's water. What's the problem? I'd like to know. This morning. Oh, do you know what? Forget the coffee. I've had enough. I'm just gonna have tea, like a normal regular person, because I have no time for this. Really Please comment down below because I probably won't have fixed it. I'll just literally ignore it now. Probably not gonna touch it for a while. Still doing it. I don't know what this means. Okay, I'm gonna try a new Lacto pod. It might be the pod. <sighs> Looks like it's tea then. So strange, I've got all of the time. They're in, oh my god, this is so weird because I can actually see better than when I have my glasses on. Oh my god, I'm so 
I use the glasses on at a distance. It's so annoying, like if you look torn off, they were torn off or anything like that, you can't see. Okay, then I'm just gonna wash my face. I've got that dents in my nose from where the glass is a bit pressing in every day. Like I was saying, my makeup is done. Um, my hair is terrible, like really bad, but it's okay. My head is going to fix that soon. Just make sure everything seems like it go out because I hate coming home to the end of my neck. It just throws my whole life off balance. Um, so everything is going to be put back where it goes. There's only days like where I don't get to do that is if I've left in an extreme rush, like I woke up late or something. But other than that, to go out and leave any mess. I just don't like it. I hate it. Look how many comes out, like five or six. Could be about eight. 
then I just go around the whole house cleaning because I don't want to waste the wipes. <laughs> I'm just cleaning my um, work top now. Just in case. So my eyes get irritated or something, who knows. Time is quarter two. So it's quarter to eight now, guys. So this is where the time goes. But I must say, my morning has been a lot easier just by doing the pack lunches from last night. So that is going to be an easier thing of mine. I don't usually do it that way, but it definitely does make sense. Oh, you know what I just realised? It's quarter to eight and I need to get the baby dressed. <laughs> that was one bit I forgot. Because um, this week, Ren's been home well, he's not the week, but he's had day off for the last school run day. So I was kind of used to him staying at home with her, so I didn't have to get her ready. Now we've got to get her ready. And I was like, oh God, I forgot. I'm going to do it now. I'll go upstairs and get her clothes and then bring them down. And then I'll just dress her downstairs. Yeah. Your vitamins. Yeah, that's part of our morning routine as well. They take their vitamins. Okay. Rian, we still haven't put back the, the milk in the fridge. Um, so they take these um, well kid immune chewable vitamins. Tell them to bring their school bags and stuff down now, please. Hmm. And my tea's still here. Oh. And it's still hot, which is good. These kids must think I've got all day to stand here waiting to give them vitamins. You know what's so weird, right? This is my upstairs toothbrush. But I could have used the other, the downstairs toothbrush is up there as well. But it's so weird. 
If I'm upstairs, I'll only use this one. And I don't know why this one even came upstairs, but this one needs to go back downstairs. <laughs> Okay, it's probably one of those things where, you know, when you're brushing your teeth and um, you're walking around the house, maybe I was brushing my teeth downstairs and I was walking around the house, I came upstairs and I was probably spat out there and put, left a toothbrush up there. Maybe that was what happened. I don't know. Girls, why is your, well, Reve, why is your laundry basket in the middle of the room? Your Bible, Rian on the floor. Somebody's phone on the floor. Hanger and a purse on the floor. Somebody's school jumper on the floor, on the chair. Chair's not tucked in. Where is that your headscarf on the on the chest of drawers? I literally have to be on onto their case every day. This, put it away somewhere, please. And I gave you the stand for this. Keep it in the stand. Is that your headscarf? Put it away. Rion, put your Bible in your room on your table, please. Bible doesn't go on the floor. Yes. Put that jumper away, please. No, because you're not even yours. The jumper, Reve, because it's yours, definitely. Come on, we haven't got all day. Charge it. You can still charge it. It's not charging where. Oh. <coughs> These kids. Hang up the cardigan. Today. Tuesday. Wow. Right. Rian, have you got your coat and stuff? Rian, put the bubble away and we'll go. Wow. I haven't even got Raina's clothes. What's wrong with me? I keep forgetting. She can wear what she's wearing now, no problem. But she's wearing my baby glow, but I prefer her to be warmer. So she can wear this track too, which is cute. I'm gonna bring her bib. And then I'm gonna bring her a spare, spare, something. spare vest. Spare vest in case. You know from her baby's nappy boot. Spare vest, there we go. That's all she can use for today. When we come home later, we need to pack these clothes away. What's the time? It's time to go, come on. Um, in the fridge. Made it already. <laughs> they said where the fuck <laughs> Usually I make it and leave it on the table. I did make your snack. Yes, I did make your snack. Oh, is it in the fridge? Mm -hmm. Put it in your bag, don't forget it today, please. Okay, sorry. Mm. I got mommy, I got strawberry too. Right, excuse me, let me change little madam. Mm -hmm. Just opening the blinds. Got a little light in the house. It's so weird. Why do we open the blinds a little light in the house? We're not gonna be in here. Turn off the night lamp. Oh my god, is it 
late then. We're late. Okay guys, so we're in the car. We're actually running late. I didn't even realise that um, we are running late. I don't know how, because it said quarter two. And then I thought, okay, we've got 15 minutes to leave. And all of a sudden it was 10 past. And now it's like 18 minutes past. And we're like, we just get in the car. So yeah, we've got a rush now to get somewhere. Quickly, very quickly. Hey guys, so it's 8.42 now and I'm back at the garage. Just gonna go to the toilet and go back out at 8.49. Just gonna go to the toilet quickly and wash my face and back on it again. Alright. Hey guys, so we finally reached school. So I've washed my face, rejuvenated myself got like four minutes before I head back out <sighs> feel awake now <laughs> mm. sun's come out that is gonna be a beautiful day today <sighs> okay guys so the first two are in oh that's mad madness 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 I can't even believe I can't even believe that we're never that late. <laughs> Literally never that late. Yeah, I need to get you into school. Oh my god, I've got a of lights on still. I need to get you into school now very quickly before your gates close. And there's temporary lights up there as well. It's annoying. Yeah, so the controller just held me back for about five minutes. So I've got extra five minutes. <laughs> Another love it when that happens. It's quite out there, so I don't mind holding back for an extra five minutes. So when you go out there, you know, holding back, you know, running too early, basically running on time. It's best when you run late, because then you don't hear from the controllers. When you run too early, every minute they're calling you, they're calling you, ah, two minutes, oh, three minutes, oh, four minutes. At the worst possible spot where you can't hold really and truly, you'll be blocking the road. So this way, let's cruise late and probably make up at the time anyway because out there is really quiet for some reason strange reason quiet out there hmm. all right guys see you guys when i get back to london bridge all right have a lovely day <laughs> right, now the kids are in, so I'm going to quickly, quickly grab like a breakfast, drive through breakfast, and then be on my way to the hairdressers. My appointment's at 10 anyway, but and it's 9 now, almost 9. So if I grab a breakfast and then... 
so slow, like really slow. And I thought to myself, I'm gonna end up being late for my hair appointment. So I just did a U-turn to go back. Now I'm going to towards the salon again. Cause I got to the salon quite early, like quarter past. And then I've spent 15 minutes in traffic trying to get to McDonald's. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is just go park up it's half nine now and then I'll probably just walk and see if I can find something to eat like Sainsbury's or something like that because Sainsbury's is right across the road so I'm just gonna go in there and grab like a sandwich or something something easy to eat um, and that'll be fine but yeah I didn't really fancy being late for my appointment because um, I still do want to pick up the girls for, um, from school, sorry. I still want to pick them up from school. It's a possibility that I might run over time, I might not be able to, but I would prefer to try to instead of not try. <laughs> but if not, obviously my mum's on standby to pick them up. But, um, why I don't really want to be late for the appointment because then I'm definitely not going to be on time but yeah so guys I will see you again when we get there I'm just heading there now I'm going to park the car then get out and possibly go in Sainsbury's or something we'll see you in a minute hey guys so um, good job I did turn around because there was absolutely no parking so I've had to park quite a long walk away from the shop so probably got a little 10 minute walk now to get there. <laughs> um, but yeah, it is one of those. It's now about quarter to 10. So by the time I get there, I'm gonna get about five minutes anyway. So yeah, it was all good time and I'm glad. And also I was gonna go back home in the morning. I wasn't gonna take everything with me. I was gonna go back home like, do all of that afterwards but if I did I reckon I would have been late so it worked out how it was meant to all of that there's a little monster no problem you coming with mommy for her hair do you? you need a hair do I never do her hair guys it's really bad like all the other things needs to be groomed like hair all done all the time this one I think mommy's like just forget like forget it <laughs> All these girls. There's all these girls with hair. Yeah. So poor you, you're just like a boy. I'm so right, I'm gonna start doing the thing. <laughs> cheeky face. Yeah. Hey guys, so I'm at the other end, what time is it now? 10.06. And I'm at the other end. Uh, doing some stretch uh, that was a long sitting down man just waiting to get on the stand the stand is a bit full at the moment so just waiting while the other drivers move up their bus so I can get on the stand properly yeah so I've managed to move up the bus I've got about eight minutes up here I'm just gonna stretch my legs Every time I come to work, it's a beautiful building. This is what I get to see every day. Beautiful. So I'll be heading back to the garage in about four minutes. When will be my break. Can't wait to eat. I'm a bit hungry now. So this is what one of our duty cards looks like. So this is what one of our duty cards looks like. You won't understand what it is. When I first started out, uh, this does look like gibberish to me. But I'm leaving at 10.18 to reach the garage by 11.26. Get your shot of the upstairs. Well, not much of a shot in the way. Uh, and that's the front. 
All right, I'm heading off. guys so i'm back now it's what 11 28 back at the garage i'm gonna go get me some food to eat now all right see you guys in a bit heading into the canteen probably just get me a sandwich okay, so i've finished eating all i had was just a sandwich egg and bacon sandwich got about 20 minutes left before I go back out I'm just gonna go shop and get me a drink and probably a chocolate Amen. yeah just walk into the shop it's 11 21 now and just go into the shop feels like it's gonna rain you feel a little raindrop coming down Yeah, let's go and shop to get me a drink. So I have to do London Bridge and back, then I'm finished. I don't finish till half three. <laughs> I can't wait. I already want to go sleep. I've got the little items. You need these when you're driving for a long time, man. Keep you refreshed and keep you going, really and truly. <laughs> so I've got some, I don't even know what this is, but this got cream in it. Got me Snickers, I got me a Polo and a boost drink. You gotta get your boost, man, when you're driving for a long period of time. So I'm on my bus now, I still got a bit of time left. But compared to this morning, it's getting really cold. This morning the sun came out and it was really warming up. I even took my jacket off. Now, I'm cold. <laughs> I'm actually cold. Uh, I'm actually cold. All right, guys. I'm gonna check my bus. I'll be on my journey soon. See you guys at the other end. I It's 1.55 and I'm at the other end. Can't wait to come off and finish. It's only 1.55 and it's dark outside. Actually, really, really dark. Well, not dark like night, but comparing to this morning, it's really dark out there. Mm. When it's like this, you know the day is finished. He's almost finished. <laughs> yeah, can't wait to get home. Hey guys, just come off the bus. Go home. I put my paperwork in the office, go to the toilet, and head home. Ah. Already transformed. 
I've been counting down all morning. Time to go home. Hey yeah, guys, I'm heading bus stop. Who gets me a bus to go home? Best time of the day. Everybody know the time to go home is the best time of the day. <laughs> I feel like walking fast, so probably before 35 I should be home. Theoretically. <laughs> Exiting the station. Yeah, so I'm on the last leg of my journey home. Should be home in the next 10 15 minutes. So I'll see you guys when I get in. walking back to the car now um so i'll see you when i get in there right guys so i am now homeward bound i'm actually really tired i can't wait to get home absolutely knackered <clears throat> um so yeah guys thank you for coming to a hairdresser for me i've got to go and get the kids now Yeah, so I'm just gonna go and get the kids from my mom's house now because she collected them from school, and then um, I'll be going home, and we'll probably see you there to close out the vlog, etc. Um, and Rowan should be home when we get home as well, so that'll be nice. Whole family home, have dinner. The rest is history. All right, guys, see you in a bit. So you can't really see me. Um, I've just arrived at my mum's to pick up the girls. Just waiting for them to come and get in the car, and then I will be going home. Oh wait, oh wait, oh wait, I'm 
so tired, so tired. It's now five o'clock in the evening. So yeah, can't wait. Hey guys, so we are finally home. I am shattered. I've just had a quick shower and got changed into my houseware. It's 5.56 so I don't want to go to bed. Literally. It doesn't even feel like that because it's so dark outside. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, excuse me, I'm going straight to bed. I'm going to bed and I'm tired. I am knackered. I could actually go to sleep right now as well. I am going to go to sleep. I could do. You are going to sleep. Yeah, I'm so tired. It's been a long day. You've been up since like 3 a.m. anyway. So, technically, sleep is over. Oh, you were up with her anyway. Yeah, I was. And she's still going on. I think she's constipated because she hasn't pooed today and she didn't did she poo yesterday? No, she didn't poo yesterday. Oh my god. I'm gonna give her some lactulose in a bottle, a little bit of lactulose in her milk and hopefully she will then be able to pass some stools and be a bit less warm. Yeah. All right, guys, that's it from us for now. All right, so thanks for spending the day with us. Yep, peace out. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs>